Hello, welcome. My name is Mark Lander and today we're going to be making paper from Harakiki or New Zealand flax for your school outreach program. So it's very exciting. I'll take you through the process and you're going to be using the paper. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Did you know that paper is made from plant fibre? And we're going to be first step in making paper is to harvest some plants. In this case, it's New Zealand flax or harakiki. And paper was invented in 105 AD by a Chinese scientist by the name of Sai Lun. And he was playing around with what to do with old ropes and clothes. And he discovered that by beating them in water, those fibres stuck together and it made the first sheet of paper and it was a Chinese state secret for 600 years and it was only when some Chinese papers were captured and made to tell the secret of paper making that it spread the knowledge of paper making spread all around the world so, pretty cool eh? we're ready to harvest and one thing that's important to say a karakia or prayer before you cut the bush the plant grows in a fan shape and in the middle is a little baby leaf, so we don't touch that. And the two parents, those are the sacred parts of the plant. And, but we can harvest the outside older leaves. Just by cutting down like that. This machine is called the Monster Chopper. Here is a rotary guillotine, so you can see it spinning around. This is our bath for cooking and it has a gas stove underneath. Now I'm going to add three potfuls of caustic soda. So I've got my eyeglasses on, I've got my gloves on and always add it to cold water. After five or six hours of boiling, it's cooked. You can see that that's changed colour and the fibre separates across the grain like that. You can pull it. This machine is called a hydropulper and what it is, it's a spinning propeller there and it's like a giant kitchen blender. This machine is called a Hollander Beater and it was invented by the Dutch in the 17th century to run off a windmill. So essentially it's a large revolving drum over a bed plate underneath. Papers set out in the studio 
A bit like making card houses. But they're out of the wind, they're out of the rain, they're away from little animals scratching at them. And after a day or so, they'll be dry, we can peel them off. Awesome! Well your paper's all finished and ready to send. So have a really wonderful time with it. Bye!